Good morning, my name is Miles Dion. I'm the Chief of Police for the City of Woodland Park. With me this morning are District Attorney Dan May with the 4th Judicial District. My apologies. I have Teller County Sheriff Jason Mikesell with me, Colorado Bureau of Investigations Director John Camper, and FBI Assistant Special Agent in Charge Mike Nordwell. We're holding this morning's news conference to update you on recent developments in this case. Today we arrested Patrick Frazee on charges of first degree murder of Kelsey Barrett, and he is currently being held in the Teller County Jail. As a reminder, Patrick Frazee is presumed innocent until proven guilty. Patrick Frazee was taken into custody this morning in Florissant, Colorado, just after 7 o'clock this morning, Mountain Standard Time, by members of the Multi Jurisdictional Task Force, including the Teller County Sheriff's Office and the FBI. Patrick was taken to the Teller County Jail, where he will be held. His mugshot will be sent to the media following the news conference through the media distribution list. Kelsey's daughter, Kaylee, is in protective custody and will be re reunited with Kelsey's family. I cannot stress enough that this is a difficult time for Kelsey's family. They are not providing interviews, period. Please respect the family's request. This has been a methodical and time-consuming multi-state operation with investigators working nearly around the clock to find Kelsey. While we have not found Kelsey at this time, information has been developed that is helping to narrow down our search. As you can tell from the arrest, sadly, we do not believe Kelsey is still alive. Our work is just beginning. We will be seeing a great deal of law enforcement activity in our community in the coming days and even weeks as we continue our relentless pursuit of justice for Kelsey and her family. As stated previously, this case has involved highly technical work involving cell phone records and other data that has led to, today, to today's arrest. We have also conducted multiple searches at Kelsey's home and other locations as part of this comprehensive investigation. I can tell you we understand you demand it, a full accounting of why this has happened and nothing is more important to all of us than determining the circumstances surrounding Kelsey's murder and bringing Kelsey and her family justice. Kelsey's murder underscores why we work together as a law enforcement community when tragedies like this occur. We hope something like this never happens, but this is exactly why we work with our law enforcement partners to solve violent crimes with our community. <clears throat> the safety of our community and our citizens is the top priority for all of us standing up here. And nothing is more important than our community's well-being. I'd like to take a moment to extend my, my thanks to our community for your unwavering support in this difficult time. On behalf of the Woodland Park Police Department and all the investigators and staff involved in this investigation, we would like to express our deepest sympathies to the family and to the friends of Kelsey Barrett. We will continue to work closely with the 4th Judicial District, the Colorado Bureau of Investigation, the Federal Bureau of Investigation, as we continue to work to the conclusion of this investigation. Thank you. I'm Mike Nordwall. I'm a special agent in charge, an assistant special agent in charge with our Denver division. Uh, Woodland Park Police Department initially contacted our Colorado Springs office shortly after Kelsey disappeared. In the last three weeks, we've assisted Woodland Park PD with the investigation and provided a variety of investigative resources to their department. The FBI would like to thank the Woodland Park Police Department, the Colorado Bureau of Investigation, Teller County Sheriff's Office, for their collaboration and efforts as we've worked alongside with them to further this investigation. Over the past three weeks, the FBI has provided our evidence response team, expertise from our behavioral analysis unit, technical analysis, and investigative resources from multiple field divisions across several states. With the Park PD has been alongside us the whole way along with our other state and local partners in, these, in pursuing these investigative leads. We've devo devoted agents solely to assist in this investigation, and we will continue to do so until the conclusion and those that are responsible for this horrific act are brought to justice. <laughs>